The Reserve Bank of India has hit the pause button, keeping the repo rate unchanged at 6.5%. But what does this mean for the economy? Let's break it down. Optimistic growth outlook. Despite global headwinds, policymakers at the RBI remain upbeat about the growth outlook. They point to robust domestic demand indicators such as credit growth, passenger vehicle sales, PMI, and capital goods imports. This shows that our economy is resilient even in the face of challenges. Focus on inflation. While there has been a decline in the consumer price index, it is still above the target of 4%. The RBI acknowledges this and emphasizes the need to rein in inflation. Controlling inflation becomes a key priority to ensure stable economic conditions. External stability. Good news on the external front. The RBI notes that the current account deficit and the fiscal deficit are narrowing, while forex reserves are on the rise. This offers significant comfort and stability in our external financial position. Liquidity conditions. The RBI is committed to maintaining stable liquidity conditions in the market. They will intervene periodically to ensure a balanced supply of money. This move aims to support the economies and financial markets overall functioning. Uncertain path ahead. The RBI has retained its policy stance as withdrawal of accommodation, indicating that the tightening cycle is not over yet. While economic growth is strong, the central bank remains cautious about inflation. As a result, the timing and the path of future rate cuts are uncertain. Conclusion As we look ahead, it's likely that the RBI will continue its cautious approach. A pause in policy reviews seems to be the most likely outcome for now, as policymakers assess the impact of previous tightening measures. While domestic growth concerns may arise in the coming quarters, a global slowdown could also intensify. It's a delicate balancing act for RBI to support growth while keeping inflation in check. This is Viral Shah signing off. Happy investing. This should not be treated as a recommendation. Please conduct your own analysis or consult a financial advisor before investing. Thank you.